friends! I'm so glad to see you back here at the Kyle Public Library visiting us for our online story times. I haven't seen you in so long. I'm glad to see you and you and you. I see you sitting down over there looking so fine waiting for a good story. Well I've got some great stories today about colors. So we're going to do some colors and some counting. And my little squirrel friend right here is going to help me take these leaves down off the tree. And I want you to help me too. Are you ready? All right, let's get started. So our first story today is a favorite. Brown Bear, Brown Bear by Eric Carl. Brown Bear, Brown Bear, what do you see? I see a red bird looking at me. Red bird, red bird, what do you see? I see a yellow duck looking at me. Can you make a sound like a duck? Quack, quack. That's right. Yellow duck, yellow duck, what do you see? I see a blue horse looking at me. What does the horse say? Nay, nay. Blue horse, blue horse, what do you see? I see a green frog looking at me. Can you hop like a frog? Can you show me? Oh, you're a great frog. All right, green frog, green frog, what do you see? I see a purple cat looking at me. Meow, meow. Purple cat, purple cat, what do you see? I see a white dog looking at me. What does the dog say? Woof, woof, that's right. White dog, white dog, what do you see? I see a black sheep looking at me. Can you show me your best sheep impression? Can you say, ba? Ba black sheep, black sheep, what do you see? I see a goldfish looking at me. You know what goldfish do? They blow kisses. Can you go like that? Goldfish kisses. Goldfish, goldfish, what do you see? I see a teacher looking at me. Teacher. Teacher, what do you see? I see children looking at me. And I see you looking at me. I see Nathan and Lincoln. And I see Ale and Avery and Ardelia and Sebastian and all my friends from Storytime. I'm sure you're looking at me. And there's Felix and Carter and Hunter and Sawyer. Hi friends, I'm glad you're with me today. There's all my children looking at me. We see a brown bear, a red bird, a yellow duck, a blue horse, a green frog, a purple cat, a white dog, a black sheep, a goldfish, and a teacher. That is what we see. And that was Brown Bear, Brown Bear, What Do You See? by Eric Carl. So here's my little squirrel friend, and he's up in a tree. And he has leaves of every color up there. Do you know what these colors are? Can you say them for me? What's this color right here? That's right, it's yellow. What about this color right here? That's right, it's red. And can you tell me what this is? It's the same color as the grass should be. That's right, it's green. And this is a favorite color because it reminds me of juice we drink in the morning. What color is that? It's orange. And what color is our tree, our squirrel friend, and these little leaves? They're brown. So we have orange, yellow, red, green, brown. And we're gonna get the squirrel to help us take all those leaves off the tree. Little squirrel, little squirrel up in the tree. Can you get all the yellow leaves down for me? 
Can we take all the yellow leaves off? Did I get them all? Oh, there's one more? Oh, there it is. All right. Little squirrel, little squirrel, up in the tree. Can you take the brown leaves down for me? How many brown leaves do we have? There's one, two, three, and four. Little squirrel, little squirrel, up in the tree. Can you take all the red leaves down for me? Can we get all the red leaves? Help me get them. There's one, two, three, four red leaves. Little squirrel, little squirrel, up in the tree. Can you get all the orange leaves down for me? There we go. Let's get all the orange ones. All right. What? Oh, I forgot one. There it is. Now I got them all. Little squirrel, little squirrel, up in the tree. Can you get all the green leaves down for me? And there's our tree, all bare. Because all the leaves came down off the tree and the squirrel helped me, but you helped me too. I'm so glad you helped me today. Can you help me count them as we put them back up? And let's see how many leaves we have completely together. So there's one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow, you counted all the way to ten. That's wonderful. 11, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 and 20. Wow, we counted a lot of leaves today. So that is great. All our leaves are back up in the tree with our little friend squirrel. All right, friends, we're going to do one more story all about colors. My Blue is Happy. This was written by Jessica Young and illustrated by Kasha Shin. Do you ever notice that colors make you feel a certain way? Our friend in this book does. My sister says that blue is sad, like a lonely song. But my blue is happy, like my favorite jeans and a splash in the pool on a hot day. Yellow is cheery, says my mom, like the summer sun. But my yellow is worried, like a wilting flower and a butterfly caught in a net. The boy next door says red is angry, like a dragon's burning breath. But my red is as brave as a fire truck and my superhero cape. Pink is my favorite, my best friend says. It's pretty, like a ballerina's tutu. But my pink is annoying, like an itchy bug bite and gum that st gets stuck to my shoe. Dad says brown is ordinary, like a plain paper bag. But my brown is special, like chocolate syrup. Mm. And a piece of earth that's just for me. Look, says Grandpa, green is young, like a small stem stretching toward the light. But my green is as old as a forest. and the statue in the pond. My cousin says that orange is fun, like a bouncing basketball. But my orange is serious, like a warning sign and a tiger 
on the prowl. Brr, Grandma says, gray is cold like the sky before a storm. But my gray is as cozy as a curled up kitten and the sound of soft rain on the roof. Shh, says my brother. Black is scary like the shadows creeping across the wall. But my black is peaceful like the still surface of a lake and the spaces between the stars. I guess colors are how you see them. And my blue is happy. I hope you're happy too. I hope you're having a great day. And I hope that you'll come back and see us again at the Kyle Public Library's online story times. Bye for now. Bye guys.